should you get and build Megala? Short answer, yes. Long answer, this entire video. Mama Gallon is a six-star summoner supporter from Colombia. A field specialist from Rhine Lab. Emperor of Penguin Logistic Good Friend. That is currently in the cooperation agreement with Rhodes Island. Megalon is a six-star summoner that deal basic arts attack. And well, summon a unit on battlefield. Megalon can summon a unique drone to help in the field. She has quite a decent general stats. Although her attack might seem low, but we'll see her ability with her drone later. As for her talents. The first talent will let her use up to 5 drones that do not block, and can only deploy 3 drones at once. The second talent will give invisibility to drones for 20 seconds after deployment. Magellan's drone can become an easy target for ranged attack. So the second talent is very useful to avoid it. And then this is her potentials upgrade. A DP cost reduction will be good for her. And then for her module upgrade. Megalon is one of the first few to receive a module on the day it's implemented. With this module, increase her attack and HP. And first summon unit to deploy will not use deployment slots. Clearly it will be very useful to save up deploy slot. And then moving to her drone stats and skills. Megalon's drone stats and skills will change depending on what skill you use. The drone will consume deploy slots, and if destroyed or retreated, it will gone, decreasing the drone number. The drones share the same HP and defense, regardless of which skill you choose. Which I think is still quite vulnerable to be targeted and destroyed. But luckily, Regan healing from operators like Perfumer and Angelina, can heal those wounded drones. Well then, let's see Magallan's first skill. Give a passive to slow target in Magallan and her drone range. And when active, bind those target. It's one of the best versatile stalling skill. Magellan can use her drone anywhere to slow, or bind large group of enemies. And apparently has the least SP cost among other skills. If you want to make Magellan into a crowd control unit, you can M3 this one. Then her second skill. Passive of her drone will deal single target arts damage. And when active, increase Magellan and the drone attack speed. The drone also will delay OE attack during the skill duration. The drone attack range is exactly one tile below the drone, which is pretty limiting. Unless the enemy is idle, or you have someone to block them. Although it can be used as a versatile arts dealer. But caster operator is undeniably more reliable. And then for her third skill. The drone will delay OE physical attack, something like AOE sniper do. When skill is active, increase Magellan and the drone attack, and increase the drone AoE range. The increased attack damage and AoE attack is really great. Because of its flexibility, this skill is amazing to deal with enemies. If you want to make Magellan into a DPS unit, this one is good to M3. As for her base skills. When producing any material, increase by product rate by 50%. And reduce all formulas that cost 4 moral or more by minus 2. So will Megalon become a good operator for your team? Megalon is one of the difficult unit to master. That is definitely not your easy win button. But if you get the hang of it, she will become a valuable unit. Because she is versatile, and work well with other operators. Either for stalling, or as a DPS unit. And because of her drones. She is a great unit to use if you encounter a stage that limit your operators. Something like contingency contract event do. That should be all. Adios.